Yo, it's a lion's war, and the stakes are high. Lord Shadow steps up, he's ready to fly. Questions in the air, they start to rain. Can Lord clear his lane without any strain? How many deaths will Lord give out this war? He gotta maintain. Find the best counter for the fender. Lord Shadow skill, he's the ultimate contender. Maps laid out, it's a treacherous path. But Lord's got the skills, he's done the math. Checking the nodes, planning the attack. He's moving forward, there's no turning back. Hey everyone, Shadow here, and welcome to another Marvel Contest of Champions video. So it's season 52. And this is war number seven. Let me make sure of that. War number seven. Yes, this is war number seven. And we're going up against an alliance called Gerbertrius. Gerbertrius? Gerber Tyrus? Gerber Tyrus. Anyway, uh, let's see. Who did they ban? They banned my girl. Lady Deathstrike, I don't like y'all. I don't like where you're thinking. All right, anyway, let's uh, check and see what they got. Do they have future Ant-Man in his favorite spot? No, they do not. Oh, well, Corvus gonna tear that up. Uh, let's see, oh, not him, yuck. All right, so I don't like fighting him for sure um but he's not that bad to deal with but annihilus i've always hated fighting annihilus but i have options for him too so corvus oh my goodness um looks like sandman might be a good option Let's see what um what he's thinking. Let me look at the uh spreadsheet here. Where is it? Spreadsheet, spreadsheet. Come on. There it is. All right. And let's see what he has assigned me. All right. So, yep. Uh for Rintra, he's assigned um Sandman and the notes after every five hit combo knock down Rintra with a heavy to reduce his mythical charges. Yep. And then for Annihilus, ho oh, ho ho. He's got me bringing in Doom. Power start one, then throw SP1 to remove Cosmic Rod. My Doom is not ranked up. It looks like I'm gonna have to rank up my Doom. If if uh I'm gonna need him. Uh, he's not as a seven star, so he's a good uh, candidate to rank five, but I just don't like ranking up my six stars uh, right now anyway. All right. Um, Red Skull, Corvus, <laughs> in the notes, kill him. That's it. Because, yeah, Corvus demolishes. Uh, Man Thing, Sandman. Yep. So I was right. Sandman for two of them. For Annihilus, he has Doom, although I could take Annihilus with um, um, my Claire. So I might ask for that because my Claire is ranked up and, and she does well. Um, what is it? Symbiote Supreme also does well, but I don't have one really ranked up. But Claire, Claire is who I would like to bring in other than uh, Doom. No need to do power start one or anything like that. She just <clears throat> will take it from him. Uh, let's see. And yeah, so that would really be the only, let me see. Because last time I messed up because he had me doing something else. No, no. Okay, good. So I don't have any of the minis. That happened to me. I was looking at this and I was like, okay, um, Doom, well, I'll just bring in Claire. But then he assigned me doom to fight or you know whatever champion it was to fight somebody else uh one of the minis and he's like okay well then who are you gonna fight this guy with and i'm like wait what because <laughs> i hadn't seen that but yeah um i am not assigned to any of those so that means claire definitely uh will work instead 
So yeah, Sandman, Corvus, and uh, Claire should do the trick. Sandman's coming to town. All right, anyway, take care. And in a moment, we will get on with the fighting. Okay, we are going in here with Sandman, Claire, and Corvus. Now, there is a very fun fight with Sandman coming up. It's the first time I've ever used Sandman against Rintra. Okay? And now, I told you guys in, I believe, the last video uh, that I went to Sandman school and learned how to use Sandman properly. So, I'm going through my rotation and everything. And it was very interesting. And we're going to see it. Uh, in a moment, but I actually laughed while I was fighting this Rentra. Okay, so you know you want to knock Rentra down a lot to um, get rid of his charges, right? So here we go, you know, and I'm like, all right, there we go, boom, knock him down, got rid of some of his charges, but I'm also trying to keep my count, you know, in order here. All right, so here we go. Knocked him down again. Did knock down some of his charges. Okay. Here we go. Boom, boom. All right, now I'm at 14. I hit, hit. Now I'm at 19. Now what you need to do here, bait out the special, hit him once, and you can go into your heavy attacks. But look at this. Boom. He's unstoppable. What, what? Boom. He's unstoppable. So am I. What? Oh, he came out of it faster. It was like Rock'em Sock'em Robots right there. It made me laugh so hard. And I looked and I'm like, wait a minute, why he got all those uh, charges? I thought I had got him down. But I'm just like, okay, whatever. We just knock him down, boom. Now you don't got none. I was laughing so hard during this fight. And I'm like, okay. So he got me off my game a little bit. I wanted to bait those out. Okay. And... I need to fire my special off, but I wanted to make sure he didn't have any uh, charges because I don't want to fire my special three and then have him go to a special three. See, right there, perfect, okay? So that made me laugh so hard because he was unstoppable, I was unstoppable, and we were just hammering at each other, hammering at each other. And so when this happened, I'm like, all right, but see, I'm unstoppable. Bam. See, here we go again. Here we go again. Ha, but I had enough charges this time. Knocked him out. I had fun in that fight, let me tell you. I don't know if you guys remember Rock'em Sock'em Robots. You know, you had two robots in a little toy ring, and you both were just, y'all were in place, and y'all were just fighting each other. Da -da 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 -da, fight, fight, back and forth, back and forth. That is what that looked like to me. And I laughed so hard. Oh, my goodness. But anyway, we got him down. Wasn't too much of a problem. Uh, I might fight that one a little bit differently if I do it again. I don't know. That one seemed to work the way that I did it work. So, of course, with um, Annihilus here, he, um, yeah, very annoying. Very annoying. Look at this. Very annoying. But see, with um, Claire, it don't matter. If I want to get my health back, I could. But see, now he ain't gonna get his uh, uh, his uh, what do you call it? Whatever that charge, uh, cosmic rod or whatever, he wasn't getting it back because she made him a uh, buff immune. And even if he did get it back, she was gonna take it from him. She likes mugging Annihilus. Let me tell you. So down goes Annihilus. So, so far, the fun fight that I had against Rintra is still in my mind, and I am just smiling. And I think I, I put a comment in the uh, in, in my line group uh, for my alliance and mentioned that. I was like, it was like Rocko Sockham Robots, you know? I don't even know if, if uh, most of them are old enough to remember that toy. But anyway, we got him down, we had fun. Now we're going to destroy this Red Skull. Oh, yes. 
Corvus is a beast pretty much on um pretty much on a lot of these fights especially on path three and he can take most anybody on this path some of them might be a little bit more difficult might take a little bit more but he can really take almost anybody here even if he loses a lot of health if he's awakened he can still get him down all right so not a big deal but red skull who is annoying he's very annoying okay um against corvus though as long as i keep armor breaking him He's not gonna really do much of anything to me on this node. Gotta keep armor breaking him. Now, look at that, bam. When I'm fighting uh, future Ant-Man on this node, if you armor break future Ant-Man, his armor goes passive and you'll still end up taking a lot of that damage. You can still do the fight, but it's not gonna be as smooth as you know, Magneto or Gladiator or somebody like that. All right. So now, next up, batter, swing, batter, 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 swing. I don't want to um, go into a fight with less health than I feel comfortable with. You know, because if I go in there, even though, you know, I don't necessarily need full health, but I lose and I didn't heal up in, in, I think my, one of my alliances, um, past alliances, you did not go into a fight with less than 80% of your health. You healed up to at least 80, never less than 80%. All right. So now this fight, I'm doing my usual, um, uh, what do you call it? Rotation here. All right, boom, boom. We're at 19, okay? Bait that out, bait it out. Oh, wait, why he messed me up like that? Because I needed him to fire the special so that I could just go, you know, ham on him, but I'm still going ham on him like this. So it's all good. <laughs> that wasn't what I had planned, let me tell you. All right, so now you want to get to like nine, before firing your special two off. Nine, bam. What that does is it gets you to 19. Bait out his special. There you go. Now, hit him and heavy attack him. I shouldn't have done all those combos, but I did. So that wasn't as smooth as it should have been. Yeah, see, all that. But look at his health. Don't matter. So I didn't do that the way I was supposed to. I'm still learning, still learning. I went to the school, but I'm still learning. Just look at him, bam, bam, boom. I'm liking um, Sandman, I really am. I love his immunities and I love the damage when you play him right. And I kind of just started going in and I knew I didn't really need to do anything crazy, set up, rotation. Just go in and, and take him out. All right, so that was the last fight that I had in this war. So we'll be back in a moment, and you'll find out just how this war ended. And we're back and we won this war. It seems like we're going back and forth, back and forth, but we are still in tier two. Okay, let's look at that. Look at that. So there's something that um, I want to show you guys, which I find uh, quite interesting. It's just the way that um, Kabam calculates things. So I took a screenshot of this because I wanted you guys um, I think it's this one here. Let's see. Let me see. Is it this one? E Let me see. I think it's this one. But you can see here, 
I only had four fights, so I only got four attacker kills. Look at my defender kills. Crazy, right? Strong defense. Um, but that doesn't really matter when it comes to the MVPs. Um, but I definitely wanted to show you guys that. Um, it always kind of cracks me up. Yeah, I think that's all you can see here. But anyway, that is going to do it, guys. Thank you all for watching. Take care. Shout out to our MVPs. And you all have a blessed day. Arena and chill grind, that's how we roll. No stress, no drama, just on patrol. In the fight, he swift. His tactics be tight, those shadows in the arena ready to ignite. From the streets to the screen, his skills be renowned in the world of Marvel, Lord, the King Crown.